Welcome back to The Sims 4 Cottage Living Rags to Riches. Today is going to be good. It's going to be really, really good. <laughs> and you know when I say that, that means it's going to be extra good. Uh, what we're going to do first is what you guys have been wanting to see a little bit is a couple of makeovers in Creator Sim for Chaz. And, well, actually, Trenton probably looks fine. I think his clothes are actually fine. Uh, but we'll give Chaz a new outfit at least. So go ahead and plan outfit. It's going to be good. <laughs> All right, well, I, I'm just going to do this and then I guess I'll see you at the end. Otherwise, we're going to be in here for like five hours. Yeah, we're going to change this outfit. I mean, I still like this. I feel like you should still have a farm outfit, but we can probably get one that's maybe a little bit. Well, I, I, you know, I kind of like this outfit. Okay, anyway, I'll see you in a minute. Why is there only like one beanie in this game that covers the ears and it's like one created by a CC creator? Like why, why, why do all the beanies in the game look like this? Who's wearing their beanie above their ears? What are you doing? It just looks, <laughs> looks so ridiculous. I guess I, get, I mean, he's an animal enthusiast. Why don't we wear this? <laughs> okay, I didn't actually really change anything. I did change this outfit. So it's just like a, a different variant that doesn't look as dirty and the pants a bit. And he's also had a haircut, you know? He's, look, he still works on a farm. He's still got to do a lot of stuff. The other outfits actually seem kind of fine. Like, I don't really have any problem with these. So, I mean, I'm fine, <laughs> except for that, that beanie's kind of... I don't know. Anyway, let's go over to Trenton. I think his are fine as well. Uh, I mean, maybe you could use a new top to sleep in. <laughs> yeah, that'll do. Party looks great. Looks great. Looks great. That's all. Done. All right. So, oh my gosh. Okay. Well, we got to do some weeding. So let's go do that. <laughs> let's go. To, actually, no, I'll specifically to say weed. Let's get them out there. Uh, so you guys go weed all the garden, please. You're both in a pretty good mood, so it should be all right. Um, yeah, so if you guys watched the last Dream Home Decorator episode, you would have seen Hazel actually now owns all three houses, um, which means that series is more or less done, but you guys did want to see one more, at least one more episode in that series before Hazel moves in here, because now that we have uh, all three houses with a whole bunch of roommates, we kind of just want to see how that pans out. So Hazel won't move in this episode. Oh, what is this? Hang on, I need you to go fix this. Yeah, Hazel won't move in this episode. But she'll come in soon. And when she comes in, we're going to make over the upstairs as well. And I think, well, like we've been needing to do the front of this place for a while. But we also, hopefully today, I want to be able to buy the little retail store that I've been talking about. Also, you guys did suggest swapping the robotic station and the juice fizzer, which I think makes sense. Because then the juice fizzer is much closer to the farm. And it also is, you know, near the selling tables, which also makes sense. Uh, oh, it's kind of... Awkwardly, well, let's get rid of this fridge because that fridge is actually kind of annoying to be honest. Because, like, when we do the oh, this kind of doesn't really fit in here because wish this was on this side, it's kind of awkward. Dang it, what if I just do this? What if it's just kind of squished in like that? I don't care if it covers this archway because again, these weren't really supposed to be doors, it's just kind of supposed to look like it's open anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this fridge because oh, actually, we're not really supposed to sell the catalog though. Although, I do that. Oh my gosh, we got so much junk in here. Oh yeah, you guys did want to make sure I get this. Uh, this is our prize winning aubergine. We should get that out. Oh, <laughs> back to! Where did we plant aubergines this time? Were they back here? Oh yeah, here they are. So I'm going to put this here and then we'll just put the little aubergine on that. Yeah, so this is now my aubergine patch. Just in case we weren't sure, we've got a big one sitting right there. <laughs> and then I think the rest of the stuff I don't really need. I do need to put um, sucker somewhere, don't I? Where did I put sucker? Isn't it? It's around. Oh yeah, it's just here. Just not really on display anymore. It's just kind of there. That's right. Yeah, this just makes a bit more sense being here. So it's like right by the selling table. If we were to start fizzing stuff, you know, we'd just uh, sell it right away, for example. That makes sense. Uh, all right, so Trent is going to go fix this so we're not wasting a whole bunch of water. All right, let's scavenge for parts and then throw that away. All right, then I'm going to get you to go back over here and say weed all. Yeah, because once all of these are grown, um, we should get a pretty good payday as well. So I'm looking forward to that. Here comes the water. Oh god, we get so many frogs. Hey, can we grind up frogs in the recycler? <laughs> we get so many just from weeding. I didn't realize you get like so much. Oh, okay. So the other thing, hang on. Let's go golden chickens. How many of these do I actually know? Because I can say ask for help, which is what I was supposed to do, which I didn't realize I was supposed to do that to actually get them to help. Um, all right. Golden rooster is a golden chicken with golden pulse powers. I'll use those powers to help you out. Cool. So then if I just do that on all of them, you as well, for example. Fantastic. Uh, that's two. There was a third one somewhere. Where did it go? A bunch of rabbits in here. I saw three, but I'm not sure where the third one went. I don't know. Anyway, keep waiting then. Oh, there it is. Hang on. Ask for help. All right. So they're all helping out. 
And I gotta, I really gotta become friends with those rabbits as well. I, I keep putting it off. It just takes so long, guys. It takes so long. So you're not helping. You are helping. So that one must be friends with Trenton. That's fine. That one's not helping. Um, hang on. Lecture about barking. Fei Fei, please. Please. Well, you might want to... Oh, learn not to bark. Fantastic. I was going to say, you might actually want to go out. So can I just say let out with you? Friendly. Oh, no. I guess that's just Hagrid. Uh, all right, fine. Let's go. Let's go for, let's go for a jog. Freddy Krooster is getting on in the years. Okay. That's sad. All right. How are we going over here, Chaz? Looking pretty good. Let's... Uh, so who's not helping? You're not helping. Let's... Get, hang on. Do I have any carrots? Well, let's go harvest this. I wonder if they... They might like cowberries. I'm, I'm willing to give them cowberries because... We seem to be growing them more often now, which is fantastic. So I'm just going to harvest all four of these because I think that helps us grow some new stuff each day. And then, all right, the carrots are... Wait, do I have carrots in here? I'm really out of sea, to be honest. Oh, yeah, here they are. Oh, my gosh, it's golden pulsing my plants. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, there we go. All right, so I got four carrots. Right, so we've got you here. I'm going to say gifting, give gift, give produce. Do we just go for a cow plant berry? Oh, no, I'll give you a, I'll give you a $500 one. Let's see if you like cow plants. Do you like cow plants? This could be a big waste of money, but you know. Here you go. You like cow plant berries? Oh, yeah. Favorite gift. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> now I'll pet you enthusiastically. That actually got us, got us pretty good relationship. So I'm pretty happy about that. I'll take the gift you're offering me as well. And uh, this should, I guess that gets us off on a good uh, start. Ooh, give me some tomato sauce. All right, you know what? It's pretty easy to become friends if you just give them a good gift. <laughs> hey, I got a new cross stitch pattern too. All right, gardening help enabled on you. That's good. All right, so there should be... How many rabbits are here again? We should have a lot. So you need help as well. Now, you are an elder, so I feel like you're going to die soon, but look, we'll get you to be my friend as well. Uh, with cow plant berries is how we're going to do it, apparently. <laughs> Let's see if that one works. Oh, see, that was just a thumbs up. It wasn't as good. Still pretty good. Still pretty good. Not as good. Um, you guys can probably go home now. Because <laughs> you are, like, busting. Wait, what are you doing? Hang on. No, I keep talking to the rabbit. One pumpkin spice milk. Very nice. And an orange egg. Dang. Okay. Come on. Let's just get friends with this rabbit, too. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's not liking me. Uh-oh, I'm in the bush. No, 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 no. Don't. No. Ugh, this rabbit is not liking me now. I told you it's tough. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now we're, like, now we're getting somewhere. Uh-oh. Yay! There we go. Ask for help. Okay. That's pretty good. I mean, still, it's like 1 p.m. It takes like most of the day just to do that. All right, you can use that. Trenton, what are you up to? Uh, whoa! You're rough, dude. All right, you can take a bath upstairs. Okie dokie. So, um, okay, the black roost is there. That's all right. So you, uh, help enabled. Not helping this one. Okay. Let's see if we can go give gift. What? Well, I'm going to give you a cow... Not a cow plant. A, a dragon fruit. Six ninety five. That's pretty valuable. I don't know if they actually care about value, but I'm going to give you something very valuable. Here you go. Here's a dragon fruit. Pretty epic. Yeah, oh, it's just a thumbs up. <laughs> I'm one of that love heart. Hey, ask for gardening help. Okay, we're making some good progress with the rabbits today. <laughs> Probably should have done this a long time ago. Oh, yeah, golden chicken. Are you, wait, are you helping me? I mean, I guess. I don't see any option to ask for help. All right, so you two are both helping. That's great. I mean, I don't know how much you're actually helping. You're kind of sitting there. You're not helping me, though. Okay, there's so many rabbits here. It's kind of confusing, to be honest. That one's not helping me. Okay, we got one over there helping. You're not helping. You're these two. Okay, there's a lot of rabbits here. All right, well let's go. Let's go get someone to eat because I think you probably need to. Let's get your needs up. Make sure you're all good. And Trenton, you can go to bed after you've finished your food. Now we also are trying to work on uh, these kind of things here. These jobs, so we can get some animal shed upgrade parts because we still don't have enough. Uh, you guys are probably hungry over here, are you? Oh no, you're actually okay. But I should probably feed you guys. Yeah, because we don't have enough to upgrade this, do we? We can do the life extender, but we can't do the auto feeder, which is kind of what I want to do. We have no upgrade parts of... Oh no, we got two upgrade parts. But I think I need six to do the auto feeder. There's missing some upgrade parts. Four upgrade parts. Is that what I'm missing or what I need in total? I always get confused by the wording of these. That one I'm I need missing one, I guess. And this one I can do. It only requires two. Yeah. So I think I think I'm missing four, or I need four in total. I don't know. You know what? I don't know. Oh, this is why I wanted to get rid of this fridge. Look, they take food from it. It's so annoying. Okay, let me just put that in my inventory. No, no, you can sit there. You don't have to get up. Did you have one bite and then that was it? Oh, well, I guess you're kind of full, so that's fine. All right, well, let's go recycle some stuff too. Clean out the inventory a little bit. Ooh, we got some pumpkins growing over there. There we go. 
A right, little bit of a recycle, should clean out some junk. Oh my gosh, 18,000 plus 500 on that as well. Oh yeah, these golden pulses going on in here. All right, so the other thing we need to do, we actually need to graft on the three plants. So I'm thinking we just go here and say, take a cutting of this Snapdragon. And then what I'm actually just going to do is just graft back onto a Snapdragon, which I mean, yeah, it doesn't make any sense, but it counts, right? There you go. Yeah. And I'll take a cutting from this one. I want to take a cutting from the same one because then we'll kill it. And I'll graft onto this one though. Because in theory, this shouldn't do anything because I'm just grafting Snapdragon to Snapdragon. So it should just grow Snapdragon again. So that's, that's my theory. And then I take a cutting of this one and then I graft it onto this one. And then there you go. We've grafted one second. Three things, and we've got a bunch of points. Now, oh, grow a cow plant. You know what? That's what we're already doing. Let's go make sure these are good. Should I fertilize them? Oh, hang on. Fertilize them with another cow plant? That seems like barbaric. Uh, wait, where are the, uh, what's in here? Oh, birds of paradise, here we go. So harvest birds of paradise. Dang, look at these chickens. They're golden pulsing everything. Awesome. What was that? I got a ding ding. Oh, it was a chicken. Sweet. All right, I should, speaking of chickens, let me go, um, I gotta make sure all these coops are tidy and collect the eggs and also probably should scatter some feed. Uh oh, bushy tailed thief. Although shouldn't we be good? Cause this is locked, this area. Oh, what was that? There's a dung dung dung. Don't dung 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 me. Oh, laminate. Oh yeah. You know what? To be fair this time, I think they actually have a point because I kind of have ignored them this episode so far. That's all right. Well, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. All right. So Chaz is cleaning that out. Trenton's just cleaning out that shit over there. And then I'll call the animals out and actually make sure they're fine. It's probably also a good idea call over laminate because I don't think for some reason I don't think you're doing too good at the moment. I clean you and then I'll feed you. How about that? All right and then you call over Caltrain and make sure she's okay and then you should be pretty good now right? Let's see. Yeah there you go. Good as new. Now my other chickens um they should be okay. Probably just needs to be cleaned a little bit. Yeah it's a little stanky. Let's go <laughs> let's go fix that. Yeah Trenton's talking to the plants. I think we need to weed them again do we? Oh no those are fine. Oh looking pretty good though. Looking pretty good. All right, Trenton. Now, are there still rabbits out here that aren't helping? So you are helping. Let's just see if there's any hanging out. Okay, you're not helping. This one here. We should probably name, let's name all these. And by name, I just mean click on them and then just have them a name assigned. Just because I think that's going to help us a little bit because it's kind of, oh, wait, can I not name this one? Oh no, this one's called Thumper, right? That already has a name. Yeah, so we've got Thumper. This is Daisy. I think it's just going to help us keep track a little bit. Now, do you have any produce on you? Oh yeah, you got some cow plants and dragon fruit. Okay, let's try those. So we're going to say gifting, gift, gift, produce, Perfect cow plant berry. Let's try that. All right, so you're, wait, did you actually clean that out or did you, oh yeah, you did. Okay, do you want to just collect the eggs as well real quick? Um, and I'll just put all the produce and stuff in the fridge. And then once we sell all of this stuff, we should be pretty, pretty sweet. All right, so we got five golden eggs. Dang. All right, Chaz, you can hit the hay. Hey, wait, did you, did you give a gift to you? I think you did. Yeah, they didn't like it too much though. All right, I see some rabbit getting to know you. It's my favorite part of this game. Ooh, take gift. Yes, please. What do you have for me? Oh, you didn't like that? Come on. What'd you give me? Hello? Oh, we, we got fishing volume one. Yeah, sweet. We'll finally be able to find out if fishing is fun or not. Come on, why can't I ask you for help yet? I feel like we're pretty good friends at this point. Oh yeah, golden rooster. Oh wait, another rooster. We don't really need another rooster. Oh, there we go. Harvest for gardening up. Okay, perfect. All right, Chaz, I'm going to get you to go use the toilet after that. Wait, did you actually do it? I feel like you... Oh no, you did. All right, so we've got a whole bunch of rabbits helping out at the moment. Not sure how many in total, but quite a lot of them are helping with gardening, which is great. Wait, what are you doing? Are you supposed to be sleeping? I literally told you to go to bed. I, I bet he got up to sniff something. That's probably what happened. All right, so who was doing robotics? Because I, I, like, I do want to kind of keep trying to do that. I'm not sure what level we have to be for a gardening robot, but let's go Tinker. Cause yeah, yeah, you're nearly level two. But if we can get a fleet of gardening robots as well, on top of everything else that's helping us, it'd be pretty epic. Hey, Fei Fei, are you okay? Yeah, I'll, oh, I can't let you out. I thought I could. Yeah, there you go. Wait, did you let Fei Fei out or no? Fei Fei just went to sleep. Likes robotics. Yes, you do like robotics. All right, so there's some more tinkering. There we go. All right, we can now uh, craft the computer chip uh, and RC quadcopter. Not great. I kind of want the, uh, the gardening robot. Oh, <laughs> aspiration complete. Sweet. Okay, so we completed that because we got the cow plant crow. Fantastic. So we actually probably have a lot of points. We've got 4,000 points. Now, what were we looking to actually get with that? I don't remember now. Probably, uh, I don't know. Let's have a look. So we've got the frugal which is great we have shameless carefree probably be good so we don't have to worry about the fun and all that 
But I'm not sure if that's... Was that what I was aiming for? Or am I trying to aim for something else? No, I think Carefree is pretty good, right? Or free services, because then we could hire a gardener and we don't have to pay them. Or we can get like a maid to come by and we don't have to pay them either. Especially because maids usually bug out anyway and don't work. So that could be good. I was wondering what else is good. I think Carefree is pretty good. Let's do Carefree. I feel, especially Chaz, I feel like he's definitely Carefree. Alrighty, so we've actually done two aspirations, which is pretty epic. Uh, we could do... Uh, what about this? What's this? Harvest 10 identified plant. Oh, that's kind of like we have to go to outdoor retreat. Hmm, I'm not really sure what he would want to do. Could be a master chef. Family, maybe? See, I don't think Chaz is really in the business of having a family. I think that's kind of Trenton at this point. It's kind of where we're going with it. Creativity, maybe. Lord of the Knits. Maybe he could take up knitting. <laughs> Animal. Oh, maybe animal, actually. That might be a good one. Yeah, he's an animal enthusiast. That makes sense. That makes sense. Okay, cool. All right, uh, you can go to the bathroom now as well. Sim is fireproof and instantly puts out fires. Oh, that's actually really good. That's a good little bonus that we've got. So now we've got, we've got a, quite a lot of bonus traits in here, which is actually pretty awesome. Trenton, meanwhile, we're still working on yours. I guess uh, we've received one gift from the rabbits, which is nice. All right, yeah, feed the cow plant. Probably a good idea. Uh, do I need to water that one? Nah, we're good. How's the rest of the garden looking? Does it need to be... Can I mean, it all looks pretty good, to be honest. I mean, is this harvestable yet? Yeah, it is. I think they're all just kind of small plants at the moment. Uh, now, you... You're not helping with gardening, but let's go ahead and name your hopper. You're not helping with gardening either. No, you can't be hopper as well. Um, you can be flopper. There we go. We've got hopper and flopper. Uh, now, do I have anything to give them? I've got a cow plant berry and some birds of paradise. All right, well, you go to the toilet. Trenton... How are you going with your robotics? You're still working away over here. That's pretty good. Three robot salvage pods. Okay. Um, well, just keep tinkering, to be honest. <laughs> oh, look. Laminate isn't out. And I'm going to guess Laminate's going to complain if I don't call them out. All right. So we'll just do all the stuff to take care of Laminate there. And then we'll do the same with Caltrina. Clean. And we'll also say feed. All right. That's all good. They're taken care of. Then we'll get some leftovers to eat. Alrighty, Trenton. We're going to go check out some more rabbits. Um, okay. You're helping. That's good. You're not helping. All right. Gifting. Give. Gift. I'm going to give you produce. We're going to give you a cow plant berry. That's usually the way to a rabbit's heart. <laughs> so stupid. No. Wait. Oh, yeah. Good. <laughs> I was like, don't, don't leave me. I just want you to help me with gardening. No, no. Don't show your fists. There we go. All right. Ask for gardening help. All right. I think we've got a lot of these rabbits helping now, which is good. Oh, look at these pumpkins. So everything is looking pretty, pretty good. Most of these rabbits are helping. Those two are helping. This one isn't. This one is, this one is, this one is. I think maybe these two over here aren't. We've got at least five of them at the moment and all the plants are looking pretty good. Okie dokie. So should we, I mean, I don't, do these grow more? I, I still don't actually know. I guess we could leave them and just see, but I think it might be good just to harvest everything and sell it, to be honest, because we need the money anyway. Oh no, no, don't, don't sell it. We need to harvest them, sorry. Harvest all crops. Oh wait, today's Saturday. Oh, that's great. That is actually great. We can sell them for more money at the festival. Ooh, it's a llama fair. Okay, so what do we need for the llama fair? Wool and unique items. And okay, so we need some llama wool. You know what, Chaz, do you want to stop that for a second? Do we have any interesting traits or not really? Not really. Uh, can I make it? Wait, does Trenton have any? He might. No, we don't really use, <laughs> I don't really use traits. Well, let's, <laughs> we got plenty of wool. Well, I'll go get you to shear some more wool. I get you to clean and then shear and then also let's just feed again because you'll be coming to the fair with us today and Trent is going to keep harvesting everything because we'll just take all of oh yeah max gardening skill and we'll also just take all of this to the fair with us which is going to be great and we'll sell it for a huge markup all right how's this wool is it excellent it was normal I think Trenton has some excellent quality wool so that's all right actually Fei Fei how are you going have you got enough food uh you do you've just been eating it but we'll fill up the main thing oh Grim's here Freddy Krooster you've been great Sad to see you go, to be honest, but, you know, we all got to have our time. Oh, no. The, are these guys going to fight constantly? I don't know. I think we're good. I think they're, they're getting that sorted. That's all right. Okay, so food is filled up. Uh, is the cow plant fed? I think so. But I'll just feed you to make sure. Oh, hey, Patchy. Here you go. Here's some more food just to be safe. All right, I'm going to need you to go harvest the rest of the stuff, too, because we I do need this all harvested by this evening or this afternoon, really. No, no, no. Oh, why'd you come over this side? Harvest all those. You know what? Harvesting all this stuff takes just as long as planting it. But we're getting there. Oh no, you've given up for some reason. I guess you're super tired. Well, the thing is, you need a win affair, and also Trenton needs a win affair. So I don't know how that's gonna work. I don't think we can both do it. Well, Chaz, do you wanna go to sleep? Because you really need a nap. 
And Trenton, keep going harvest all this, please. The good news is, whoops. Oh, these, oh, these aren't harvestable yet. That's why we didn't get them. Oh, okay, that's fine. Okay, we have a few left. That's kind of annoying, but that's okay. We've got a few left. Um, hello? Who's this? Hello? Friendly introduction. I'm not even sure who that is. Some dude. Hey, man. What's up? I'll ask about your day and um, brag about my handiness skills. They're pretty good. <laughs> They're pretty good, man. I can I can whip up anything. You see this whole farm? I built this. I built this place. All right, you can leave now. <laughs> All right, so the fan's gonna start in like 30 minutes. I'm just gonna get you to also go have a nap. So okay, so who? What is more important here? Win a competition ahead on, on Bagley's Finchwick Fair. I feel like this because then we can complete this aspiration and get more build discounts. I think that's more important than Chaz's one. And I'm wondering if Chaz specifically has to win this or just someone in the household. So we'll just see if Trenton can win. We'll give it a go, but I mean, no guarantees here. All right, fair starter, that's all right. We'll just have a little bit of a nap first to get our energy up. <gasps> Hazel, oh, why are you going? Pepper's pub. Oh, that's not the pub, is it? No, it's Gnome's arm. Dang it, Hazel. Uh, no, I gotta say no. We are officially dating Hazel at this point in time, which is pretty exciting, but it's the fair day. So she should know that's the most important day in our week. Um, she should know that. Right, you gotta take a shower as well. All right, so yeah, you guys go get ready. You'll go to the toilet. You go grab Laminade. Actions put in my in... Oh, Laminade is moving. Okay, good for Laminade, I suppose. I don't know. All right, Chaz is having a shower. We're going to open up this. Grab all the eggs to sell. There's probably more eggs we could go grab as well from the actual coops. Uh, I guess I should probably do that. Hey, collect eggs. All right, and then actions put in... Oh, wait, what? Wait, where the heck is the put in inventory button? Why can't I put you in my inventory? Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, there we go. So we got laminate. That's good. Uh, Trenton, you want to go get these eggs? Quickly get everything we need. What are you doing in there, Patchy? Get out of there. <laughs> all right, we've all got we've got all the stuff we need. We've got a bunch of produce. Uh, are these? These might be ready to harvest now, maybe, if we're lucky. No. All right, let's go to the fair. Okie dokie. So who's going to do what? Oh, you're a bit sad from the chicken dying? Yeah. Well, you go here. And Trenton, you're going to enter the, the fair. Submit entry there. And we're going to submit an entry there. All right, Laminade goes there, and oh, which is the excellent, normal, 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 excellent, excellent. There we go. Wait, did you, what are you doing? Why are you submitting an entry again? Oh, there we go. Okay, so Laminade is in and puts out some excellent llama wool. Fantastic. And then I'm going to give all the produce, uh, oh, where did Chaz go? Did he, what, where'd you go? Get back here. Uh, I'm going to give all the produce to Chaz. I totally forgot to save before traveling. I forgot that that was a thing. Oh my God, this is so laggy trying to drag it across. Okay, I think Chaz has all the stuff we're gonna sell. That's good. Now, where are you? Oh, you went over there. Okay, come back here for a second. And then we're gonna say haggle with Kim. Hey, Kim, what's going on? I gotta, is that a no? Oh no, that was yes. She, she always looks like really upset about it too. She's like, I don't wanna do this. Now, none of this produce is that big, unfortunately, but there's so much of it that it's actually kind of worth a lot of money. So, it's the small water. Oh my gosh, look how much money we've got already. Okay, so $22,000. Thanks, Kim. <laughs> now I go haggle with Aggie and we get the seeds for cheaper, right? Are you crazy? No, I'm not. I'm not crazy. I'm just going to haggle again. Are you crazy? No, I'm not crazy. Charisma level six. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's so funny. I right, discounted items. Okie dokie. So we need seeds. Here we go. All right, so there was a suggestion to, because we've got the six garden patches, but there's only five oversized uh, plants. That it was with the sixth one, we that's the one we focus on and fertilize and make giant crops of oversized ones, which is great. So I like that. So let's first of all start off getting 12 of each. Wait, she doesn't even have all of them. She only has four of them. Oh, no, 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 it's down here. Never mind. <laughs> okay, we're good. Okay, so we've got 12 of each. Wow, that's so cheap. And then we need... So we've got another 12 that we can fit in, but obviously five doesn't divide into 12. So there'd probably be two of each and then plus, I guess, another two of one of them. So let's go two more watermelon, two more pumpkins, two more mushrooms, two more lettuce and four more aubergine. Very nice. Then what about some fertilizer? Does she have like infinite amounts of that or not really? She only has growth. Well, there is an infinite amount of grow fast and hassle free, but like... I don't really care about those. All right, that's fine. 890. That's actually pr pretty dang affordable. All right, well, Chaz can probably go home. He doesn't really need to be here anymore. Uh, now, Trenton. Uh, let me just go haggle with Kim, actually. Uh, oh, it's... Oh, we just missed it. It just closed, right? I was going to say, what's going on here? I can't buy. 
Ah, oh, that's fine, whatever. I was going to check the special items because I totally forgot when I first checked, but that's fine. Alright, well, Trenton is super tired, so we're just going to do the age-old method of doing that. Now, Chaz is at home, so you can say, uh, care for self. And just so you're not so sad when we get home. And we sleep on the bench, and now we wait for the results. I might actually go need to care for you a little bit, though. <gasps> Hazel! No! Why do you keep up? No, you come here, Hazel. No. Hang on. Look, I want to hang out with you, but why do you keep asking? I'm you know it's the fair day. The fair day is the most important day of the week. I'm not going to ask him to ask invite here. But you come you come to me. <laughs> look, I would meet you halfway, but like, look, I just it's just not possible right now. Hazel? Did she say yes or Oh, yeah, so it should be right over. Ah, oh, there she is. Oh, she got a pile of trash. Okay. <laughs> She's like, "Here, this is what I think of you. You're a pile of trash. I'm going." You turned down both ways. What? You made me feel uncomfortable. She literally dumped a pile of trash in front of me. Okie dokie. She's actually like, this is you. Oh, she is not happy. Look, Hazel, you just got to understand that the fair is really important to me. And I just, uh, you know, let's just, how's your day, babe? Look, how's your day? Do, do you mind? Can I, can I clean that up? Or, no, no, I'll just stand in the, I'll just stand in the pile of trash. You know, I deserve it, I suppose. You know, screw me. Screw Trenton. Oh, no, the mayor's got it. Okay. Oh, no, the mayor just chucked it down, too. Okay, cool. Thanks, guys. What is in this pile of trash? Hey, mayor. Actually, mayor, do you have any um, errands that will give me animal shed upgrade parts? Might as well check while I'm here. Uh, no. Okay. Where are the other people? Is Kim still around or is she gone? Agatha's here. What about you? Fair will end in an hour. Cool. That's all good. Hey, Agatha. Uh, do you have any errands for me that will give me an animal shed upgrade part? Nah. Cool. What about you? So, Hazel, do you mind? I just gotta go talk to the grocery deliverer. <laughs> Alright. Oh, Animal Shed. Yes. Uh, Upgrade path for Animal Shed. Yes. And just break it. Okay, so we got two. Take a photo. Oh, yes. This one again. Okay, we've done that one before. That's right. Deliver two bottles of milk. Okay, well, we can do all that stuff in time. Um, now, how's this fair going? It should be done. It's like 10.30 p.m. So, everything's disappearing. Okay, Lima is in my inventory. That is good news. I got 75 bucks, which means I probably didn't win. Um, the wool submitter wasn't a winner this time. Okay. Well, what about the llama? My llama won third place. Wasn't there only two llamas? All right. Well, this is just, this is just the worst. This is just the worst. <laughs> okay. Uh, Chaz, you can probably just go to sleep and Trenton come back here as well. Let's just both go have a nice, let's have a good nice. Oh, actually before you go to sleep, hang on. Maybe go put llaminade back. How are the bills going these days? Haven't really checked on those for a while. Pretty good. Only like 2,000. I mean, look, they used to be, well, how, how much did they used to be? Like six, seven thousand dollars or something? Oh yeah, we also have the 50 grand now. I should probably buy that lot, hey. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna buy a retail store and it's gonna be the one in town that I was telling you guys about, which is the one that's like right behind my head. This one here, three crumple bottom street. So we're gonna buy it furnished. We still have 13 grand left. This is, this is pretty good. So the idea with this, if you don't know, is we're gonna buy this and from now on, whenever we get the harvest of all the crops, we can sell them in this store. I don't know if we'll sell all of them because I feel like it could potentially take a very long time, but it's a fun little thing that we can go to and maybe sell some stuff if we wanted to. Uh, so I'm gonna put, let's just put 10 grand in here. May, may as well, there you go. So we've got 10,000 in the business funds. Like I said, it comes with a bunch of stuff. So this house was actually a fully furnished house, but I've essentially emptied it except for the bathroom and the kitchen because I felt like that would kind of be useful in our store still. So this is gonna, essentially we're gonna convert it into a little shop. Uh, but I guess we'll do that once we actually have stuff to put in it. Cause right now we don't really have anything to put in here, but we've got the cash register there. People will come in. Uh, it's gonna be a grocery store essentially. Well, you know what? Let's get the, let's get the stuff. Oh, uh, look, we got all this produce in here already. So what it's gonna be retail items. We're gonna get a bunch of the, like these. Yeah, the refrigerated one. And then we'll put in our like oversized produce in these guys. Hmm. There's not a lot of space in the current layout to do this. Is there? Put one over here. <laughs> kind of like a little grocery store is the idea. I think this light is maybe hanging a little too low. So we'll replace that light fitting. That's all right. We'll just get the smaller version of it. I, it's not, it doesn't look great with this current layout. I'm going to be honest, but look, we're going to roll with it and then we'll see what we can do. <laughs> so it's only got a few things here, but then essentially I don't have any oversized produce right now, but what we can do is then put stuff in here and sell it from these. We can hire employees and all that. So I think that'll be really cool. But obviously we have to wait for the next harvest for that. So let's go back home. So I, I'm really excited for that. And then, okay. 
So Trenton, you're actually in a pretty good mood. You had a good night's sleep. Chaz is also pretty good. He's just a little hungry and he's sad because of the chicken. Is there a trait that makes us not never sad? Is that a reward trait? Because that'd be awesome. That's what we need. It's like never sad. But I don't, I don't think that's a thing, but that would be useful. Nah, yeah. ah, whatever. All right, Trenton, um, you are pretty good. So I'm going to get you to go. Let's go get some milk from the cow. Because if we can get a few more animal shed upgrade parts, that would also be great this episode. So we can, I feel like we can make some more progress in that sense too, you know? So two bottles of milk should be pretty easy. We just do that. All right, so we've got six bottles. That's easy. I'm just going to chuck them in the fridge. And then before we get the grocery deliverer, we'll uh, do this stuff again. Oh, the chocolate pie as well. Can I make that? Do I have the stuff for it? I need a regular, oh yeah, see the regular egg is actually, <laughs> that's actually one of the most difficult things for me to get is regular eggs. Because I keep getting golden eggs all the time. Anyway, let's clean that out. Um, no eggs in there yet, actually. Wait, what are you doing? Oh wait, no, you're, you're fine. Yeah, okay, so and then I'll get you to go, can you go clean that? And then I guess, no, that one's fine. Cool. Any eggs in here yet? Nah. Ooh, collect eggs. Let's have this regular egg. Oh, how good does this garden look? I'm so glad that I did this. And, uh, and that your, all your feedback made this so much better as well than the, than the original one. I think that looks so cool. All right, let's go get those eggs. Please have a regular egg in there. The one downside to having a bunch of golden chickens is not getting regular eggs. Oh yes, we got one. I mean, I can just buy them from the grocery store, I guess, but you know. All right, let's cook a chocolate pie. All right, chocolate pie, there you go. Chaz, you are hanging out over here with Fei Fei. You know, we'll say uh, play and pet and Okay, I'll just take a photo. That's cool. Wait, did you take a photo of a trash plant? Is that what you just did? I think you just took a photo of a trash plant. Okay, you took another photo of a trash plant. What are you doing? <gasps> Ooh, cow plant. I need to feed you. Hang on. Do not eat the cake. Do not eat the cake. Alrighty, so we got the pie. So let's put that in there. Let's go to the toilet real quick. And then I need a couple of bottles of milk. I'm just trying to get most of the stuff ready so we can uh, complete that errand. And I'll just invite both of these people over. I right, give you the chocolate pie and deliver milk. All right, what did I have to do with the mayor? I had to do something with the mayor. Chat about the mayor. Oh, chat about the mayor. Okay. Oh, I need to give you a chocolate berry as well. What the heck, man? Think we, do we still have something in here? Oh, I do. Oh, actually, I've got a bunch of my inventory anyway. All right, there's that. All right, so we got, the, I think we just got some shed upgrade parts, which is good. All right, so I give a chocolate berry. Didn't I just do that? Hang on. Is it not? Oh, yeah, give chocolate berry. I thought I just did that. All right, there's your chocolate berry. Yeah, yeah, there it goes. Good. And then I need to chat about the. Wait, no, I did that. Take a photo outside of- okay, make a cross stitch. Oh, okay, fine. I thought I needed to talk to the mayor as well from memory, but I guess not. Anyways, let's go do a small cross stitch. Man, this cross stitch takes ages. No, don't stop. Oh, finger hurts. I'll oh, get over it. <laughs> Dang it. All right, let's get some leftovers then. Uh, do I still- I do still have milk. Put that back in the fridge. Did some- I think my chicken just golden pulsed this. Because I, I know you guys are saying that, that they can golden pulse any, like, craftable. And I think they just did, because it just, like, glittered. How long till that's gone? Two hours? Really? What if I take a shower? Will that make you feel better? To get going now. Dang it! Okay, well let's go take a photo outside of Henford on Bagley. That's the other thing we have to do. We're gonna go to good old Windenburg. That's where we took a photo last time. Let's take a photo of the White Cathedral. Alright, let's go ahead and take a photo. Oops, oops, oops. <laughs> I'm clicking on the wrong buttons. Hang on, no, no. Just, take, just take a photo. Regular photo. There you go. Whoa! Hey dude! It wasn't even a photo of you, but I'll just take a photo of you anyway. All right, then I gotta give the photo to the grocery deliverer. All right, well, let's just go back home, I guess. Uh-oh. That's mm, probably not a good sign. Uh, please don't be broken. Uh, please work. Oh, okay. Okay, we're back here. I th hopefully that's fine. Hang on, bring, bring Trenton. Are we good? Are we good? Did I lose anything? I don't think so. That scared me though. Um, that, that definitely scared me. Let me just hit save on that. Okay, I also have a backup from before I started this episode, so we should be okay in case this breaks everything anyway. All right, well, Trenton, you might as well go have a sleep. You can't do anything anyway. Now, I got a bunch of stuff I need to plant, uh, so I guess I should probably start doing that. Let's... Hello? What was that? <laughs> well, let's go harvest all these crops. Oh my gosh, we could sell these in our store. There's not too many, but we could definitely sell them. Oh my gosh, we should, we should. This will be fun. This will be really fun. I love the retail stores. All right, let's grab, grab those. And then I will plant... Um, let's plant the aubergines. Oh, I've got golden pulse. Do you see that? My chickens are helping. Yeah. Uh-oh, object placed in household inventory. Dang it. I think it's because the rabbits are standing there whenever that happens. But I can seem to just place it down again anyway, so I don't know. All right, well, I planted those. That's fine. I'm going to go... Let's go to the store. Let's go to the store. I want to do this. Now, I also don't even know if this is going to work, but <laughs> we're going to find out. 
So, oh, look at these little orbies. These aubergines. Now, I have move objects on, so I can actually place a whole bunch of them in here, which I am fine with because we have a lot of them to sell. This is my aubergine. Uh, what? That's so cool. Oh, no. Do I, am I going to have to set them one by one? The pri What the heck is going on out there, Lilith? Oh, this is so cool. Wait, what are the giant ones going to look like when they're put in here? Okay, so I've definitely realized a problem with this store idea uh, is putting them all in here <laughs> one by one. I don't know. Is there a quicker way to do this? Because now I still have a bunch left over and I think now I have to go through and click set for sale on all of them. If we have like hundreds of these, it's going to be rough. But I mean, for a small amount like this, it's okay. So now we can go set uh, all our store stuff, set store prices. No, no, no. we're going to go pricey. 50% markup. Let's go do it. I'm also going to lock door for everyone but employees. And this one here as well. Lock door for everyone but employees. So that means customers can only use the front. Oh, I guess I should be able to use a toilet though, shouldn't they? Well, they okay. Okay, fine. Unlock this. And then I'm going to say lock this. Everyone but employees. And also the side door. I don't want them coming in here. And I don't want them going through this way. Okay. So customers should be able to go through this door and use the toilet. But they can't go through this door. Or I should probably also lock this door. And then, yeah, that's the front door. Now upstairs, hmm. I think I just need a door in front of the stairs or something because I don't want them going up here. How do I, hmm, how am I going to do that? I might just have to shove the door in the corner like that. Not ideal, but I don't want them going upstairs, you know? So now I should just be able to lock this door here as well. So what this will allow us to do is have, obviously the customers can use the toilet, that's fine. Uh, and they can shop in the front area, but they can't go upstairs. So we can put our own stuff up there and all that. All right, so let's go ahead. I'm going to put the rest of these. Uh, hmm. Well, I guess I could put them out for sale as well. Might as well. Get some more watermelons in the store. Oh, yeah. Okay. So now we set the prices. Oh, we could do uniforms. Should we get an employee? We should get an employee. Manage employees. Here we go. Who are we going to hire? Do we know any of these people? I don't know any of these people. Okay. I just want someone good at sales. For sure. I don't care about the other stuff. Oh, my God. Wait, it's Column? Why is Colum looking for a job? Okay, let's hire Colum. She's not even that good, but I'm gonna hire you anyway. Colum Bigwell at the Witch. This doesn't seem like a good idea. Don't people get disgusted by her? This seems like a terrible idea. Oh well, let's give let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Let's open the store. <laughs> okay, how are my needs, by the way? I'm pretty good. I should probably maybe get a bed and stuff here as well, um, because you can't technically live on a retail store, but you can. Kind of like you can't set it, you can't sell stuff from your own house like a retail store, but you can easily buy stuff and use it like a house. So we'll do that. I think this is supposed to be the main bedroom. So we'll just use this. And I'm just gonna go. Might as well upgrade the bed while I'm here. Get the double upgrades going. Oh Hazel, you want to go out to hang out tonight? Nah, I just opened my store, Hazel. You don't understand. Oh yeah, look at all these people. Wait, what's Colin doing up here? Oh no, I should maybe have locked employees out of this area too. Can you hang on? <laughs> Hang on, I'm going to need you to um, criticize, check. How do I assign a job to you? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I need you, oh, assign worked out, here you go. Uh, answer, yeah, answer customers' questions, go do that. You, you go, you go now, please. Thank you. And you know what? I'm going to lock this door for household members only, actually. So employees can still come into this area, so we might even do like a break room. That'd be cool. And this one will be locked for everyone but household members. Yeah. Oh my gosh, look at the store is buzzing. Heck yeah. All right, let's resume those upgrades. Okay, Colum is doing some magic or something. I don't know what's going on, but <laughs> she's in the store. Okay, guys, you can come into my fresh uh, food store. I guess we should probably name the place. Hey, how do I, can I just name it in build mode? Bricks and Co. Grocer. Hmm. I don't know about that name. You can come up with a better name down below, but let me know in the comments down below what we can call it. But at the moment, it's called Ricks and Co. The Co. is Trenton. <laughs> Oh, they're looking pretty, pretty keen over here. The thing is, the amount of time, like, the, we make money so much quicker by just selling it to Kim. But at the same time, I don't know, I just think this is cool. I don't think this is really a money-making scheme. But I think it's just a cool, little, fun little idea, you know? There's just no way this is going to ever make us more money in a more efficient way. Oh my gosh, we have a sale. We got our first sale. Yeah! Now we get to reap the beautiful profits. <laughs> we're going to get like, what, $70 maybe if we're lucky? Wait, where are we? Oh, he's glitching out on the stairs. That's right. It's a good stair glitch. Alrighty. Yep. That'll be one watermelon. Is that it? You sure you don't want two watermelons or maybe an aubergine as well? You know, might be good. Wait, $7? Seven? What? Oh boy. Is this going to do a glitch where these aren't really worth any money? I mean, that definitely is not worth... Oh wait, are these gone off? Hang on. These don't have... Hmm. These did say over here, or at least some of them did, how long they were fresh for. 
Oh no, this whole idea could be scuffed, guys. Restock for five dollars? I mean, it says they're 52. I think it's scuffed. I think we might not be able to do a store. Oh boy. Well, let's see what the next one sells for. Okay, here we go. We got another one. We got another one. All right, ring up castle. Oh, we got. Oh, look at all this. We got two. We got two. Come on. Stop glitching on the stairs. Let's go. All right, you ring up this customer. Let's see how much we get for this. Oh my gosh, we got three. Now these are all like 50 bucks at least. So they should definitely be worth more than $7. Oh boy, $7. Okay, I think we may have hit a roadblock with this whole scheme. Uh, that these are apparently not worth any money. I got another $7. Okay, uh, this is not working, guys. <laughs> okay, shut it down. Shut it down. This is not making money. Everybody get out of my store. Uh, well, that's, that is a shame. That is a shame. Um, I, uh, I'll be honest. I was really looking forward to running the retail store and making money that way, but it doesn't, it doesn't seem like we're going to be able to make money if everything sells for seven simoleons instead of the minimum of 50 without it should be. Uh, if you guys know a way we could change that, I don't know if someone's made a mod to fix that like i remember back in realm of magic we tried to do a potion shop and the same thing happened like the potions were worth zero simoleons and then someone just made a mod to fix that so i don't know is there a mod to fix this as well or i don't know look the thing is this is never going to be the way we're going to make a bunch of money but i just like the idea of it i think it's fun it was going to be cool but it's, <laughs> we're selling for seven simoleons per thing not worth it Anyway, I had a lot of fun this episode. I think it's, I think it was really cool that we have bought this house. Uh, next video is going to be Dream Home Decorator Let's Play again. We'll play with Hazel and all the roommates. And then after that, she's going to move into the farm. And uh, we're going to have some kids on the farm too. And then I think we can do some farm makeovers, get some stuff for the kids. Oh, you know what would be really cool? If we build like a little tree house for the kids on the farm somewhere. Ooh. I think there's a lot a lot of potential left uh, for that farm to develop because you've got basically the whole half of it to go. But yeah, let me know about this retail store if there's anything we can do or if we should just keep this as like a decorative a decorative kind of thing. Um, but I think we should probably still sell to Kim. <laughs> All right, thanks so much, you guys. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.